With the lively strokes of their brushes, young Syrian artists bring colors back through meaningful paintings to a colorless place, stripped from life by the long-running war in Syria. Those artists chose to draw paintings of people, buildings, or anything that could add life to the Yarmouk camp, which was once a home for Palestinians and Syrians south of Damascus. They brought their boards and colors and set them up and in the ruins and destruction of the camp, trying to rebuild that area through their art. Gray and black are the only colors in the area before these artists, who are mainly students in the fine art faculty, launched a project called Dash, Arabic for Grass. The idea of naming the project grass is to reflect on life, as the grass always grows anywhere, resembling life that grows from among the dead. الفن هو شيء يعني مثل إنه بيعطي لون للحياة فالمنطقة كتير سودة وما فيها ما فيها حياة أبدا فنحن عم نحاول نرجع نرجع الحياة عليها يعني من خلال الألوان. Speaking more about this project, Abd al Nasser Naji, the organizer, who was a resident of Yarmouk camp, said life shall return to that area despite what the terror label groups did. برشة عشب هدفنا هدفنا منا إنه لنعيد الحياة. نعيد الحياة من شو معمل الإرهاب في هذا المكان شو معمل فيه ننضوي بس على الحياة إنه العشب عم يموت بين الصخور الحياة عم تنبت بين الصخور إنه المخيم بحاجة لهاي الشيء يعني بعد اللي صار فيه بعد ما عملوا المسلحين فيه والإرهابيين اللي عملوه فيه بحاجة شوي ل... لألوان ما هي اللون هو حياة لما تشوف اللون الأحمر واللون الأصفر واللون الأبيض واللون الأخضر هذا ألوان كلها ألوان حياة هاي